How to do it everybody, it's Friday. But I still have to work all weekend on the house. But uh, I did get off early today, which is awesome. So it's like noon. We're gonna go over and do some wiring at the house. Hopefully get a lot done, because that would be awesome. We gotta make sure that our pool is all correct. And then we'll, we'll make sure, we gotta put more chlorine in it. And this is the first time this pool has ever been tested by us. I should say. I'm sure it's been tested before us, but this is the first time we've ever tested it. What do you think? What does that most look like? Maybe like here? Uh, no. Or here? That one. 1.5? Let me see. What do you guys think? Oh, I think it's the bottom one. Our pool, <laughs> when I was trying to figure out the size of it, there is so much water in this pool, it's not even funny, because it used to have, well, it still has the slide, and it used to have a diving board, so it's deeper than most pools. So it's an eight foot deep pool, and I'm sitting there like trying to figure out all of the different dimensions, and it kept coming out so big, and I was like, this thing is huge. And so what I figured was, if I just took this, and like, it's, it's pretty much just two circles, right? And this one's three feet deep, and then that one's eight feet deep, right? Thereabouts. And if you do that, it's like 27,000 gallons. So I'm, I'm basing this off of a 30,000 gallon pool because I'm assuming that the middle part maybe takes up a couple hundred. I guess I'll do 27, 20, 28,000. That's probably pretty good. And it wants me to add 1. 105 ounces of 10% bleach if the jug is 96 ounces. So that's... Uh, We'll have to look and see how many ounces those jugs are. That's like one in a little bit. I figured since there was so much talk about knob and tube that we were doing, I should show you guys what knob and tube is. That's a knob. That's a tube. They would drill the drill through the studs, put that through, and then run the wires through. The wires are real ugly. Um, it's all this stuff on the ground. Well, some of that. Some of that's Romex. That's the knob and tube wire. That's the, the positive, and then there's a white one that's the neutral. Or this is the hot. And then there's a white one that's the neutral. You can see the white one down there, right there. Yeah, it's like the really long one over here by the bathtub. That's the white wire. Mm, and then there's all this old nasty Romex up here, which looks like this. And that's got. Two wires. No, no, this one's got three wires in it, but they ran it wrong, so we're getting rid of it. Eh. I'm like wiring this house blind. Can't see anything. Well, that's okay. Because we're downstairs now. Yeah. It's the last wire for the attic. Well, last main circuit wire for the attic, I should say. Yeah, check it out. We still oh have, yeah. Still have to do all the outlets. But at least we got this part done and that was the hard part. Yeah, <laughs> sort of. It was one of the hard parts. Oh, that was the, look, I closed up the attic. That was the last of the main wires. Uh, I still have to do all the switches and outlets and everything, but I made Jen write her name in here. I put Tim loves Jen and then we put the date. Sorry for you guys from England. We do it backwards. November 22nd, 2013. The day that will live in infamy. Aside from like December 7th, but this one's another day and it'll be there forever. So I'm weird sentimental like that. And now it'll live in there forever. Yeah. Look guys, I'm clean. Oh no. I was underneath the house. You're just covered in mud. Yay. Look at that. Can you guys see all this? You got a dirty butt. Hey. Yeah. You want me to go outside so they can see better? Yeah, they can see the lights right on you. Oh my god. Now you're just backlit. You're backlit. Oh my god. And I didn't do anything. <laughs> Holy cow. Oh. oh my goodness. Little Timmy had to take off all of his clothes. I'm naked. Don't I look like I like how I put my towel up past my belly button so I'm like an old school wrestler? You're like a dad. <laughs> I will have you guys know after we added just that little bit of chlorine, I tested it. And it's up to four, or it was up to three. It was in good standings where we wanted it. 
And, uh... You're just, like, yelling. Well, I'm just trying to make sure that they can hear me. And our pH was at 7.8, which is a little bit high, but not too bad, because we're not in there right now, and I just put a bunch of chlorine in there, so I would imagine it might be high. I'm all cleaned up, and uh, we're going on our way to Sam's. I still haven't eaten yet. It's like 6.30. Man, I'm hungry. Jen just said to me, as she's driving, she was trying to look right, and she goes, your beard is so big, I, like, can't see past it. Yeah, that's right, folks. <laughs> Beard is big enough that it, it creates it its own blocks. blind spot. Yeah, it's like blocking traffic. We have a full day of electric ahead of us tomorrow, so I'm gonna go to bed and get some sleep and get ready for that. It's not gonna be fun. It's all underneath the house and it's gonna be very dirty, but the hope is that tomorrow we will get the four main legs underneath the house run and the main line from the outside panel over to the inside panel and the new panel installed. That's the hope at least. So that we can start powering things up and running wires here and there, like running outlets and switches. I hope that's what happens, because that would be awesome. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Now it's time to pay the price.